My name is Leo Perez. This is my PMP5 pitch for Music Madness. Music Madness is a single player music theme simulation game. The player is trying to fix their DJ equipment in a club by checking and changing wires, moving volume sliders, plugging and unplugging wires, checking power strips, etc. The player must complete this task before the owner decides to throw you out, but the patrons want to know why the music has stopped and keep coming up to ask you questions. The game will take place in a 3D world where you will have to move between multiple pieces of equipment such as mixing boards, speakers, computers, and power strips. To play Music Madness, the player will not need to know anything about DJ equipment because the beginning of the game will start with simple troubleshooting such as the volume is too low, power is off, or something is unplugged. As the game progresses, troubleshooting will become more difficult, the player will have to start replacing wires and having multiple problems at one time. The goal is that the player will learn basic troubleshooting techniques and basic functionality of the equipment in the early levels. An example of an early level would be that no sound is coming from the speakers. To resolve this issue, the player must rise the volume where the wires are plugged in. The game will also have a tooltip that can be turned off. These tooltips may sound something like, if nothing is working on a component, check the power. It may be turned off, unplugged, or plugged into a power strip without power. Or, if one speaker is working and another is not, try switching what channel the inoperable speaker is plugged into. If the speaker that was inoperable is fixed, the issue is with the previous channel. If it remains inoperable, the issue is either with the connection wire or the speaker. As you work, guests may walk up to you and ask why there is no music playing, revealing three possible answers. The player must select an answer before being allowed to continue work on their equipment. The three available answers will result in a fight, another question, or satisfying the guests rewarding more time for you to work on your equipment. The response leading to another question will be less respectful than the one granting more time, but will be similar. If you select this answer twice, you will frustrate the owner and reduce the amount of time you have to work on your troubleshooting. The answer that will lead to a fight will cause the player to be kicked out immediately, but will be relatively easy to identify, either being rude or about an unrelated topic to the question. This mechanic is meant to simulate the annoying and monotonous questions people ask when someone is attempting to focus and repair something. How much longer is it going to take? Are you about done? What's wrong with the equipment? The player has the option to play with or without this mechanic. Playing with it can grant much more time if the player keeps answering correctly, but may have their concentration broken multiple times. The antagonizing force of Music Madness are time and frustrated patrons, as ma managing either poorly may result in losing the game and having to start over. Developmental risks of the game would primarily be balancing the time and difficulty. If the solution is too easy, the game would be boring, but if the time is not long enough for the more difficult stages, the game may be too frustrating. This game will play similar to Car Mechanic Simulator 2015 by having the player move from one component to another, having to change parts, and having to return something to working order from where it was not working previously. This is my pitch for Music Madness. Thank you for watching.